So in America, we have the religious right that is trying to claim that birth happens at inception, conception. In other words, the minute that the sperm hits the egg. Okay, great. But does the soul begin in the sperm or the egg? Isn't that like the, did which came first, the chicken or the egg? Because the reality is what they're trying to presume about women and their bodies is that if they have a night of passion with a stranger, that they're supposed to carry that child from not a love affair to full term and be fully liable, fully financially responsible, fully spiritually endowed to handle the spirit and soul of that child and bring it to something that's not grown wild and openly emotionally healthy enough to handle it, all the stress of going through pregnancy and all the difficulties that go along with it and all, did I say finances, the expenses of dealing with it and did we talk about the education of a child and the cost of that and we talked about the financial aspects of actually clothing a child, feeding a child, bringing a child up to college age and beyond? I don't think so. And what you're saying is that a night that a stranger decides to fucking rape someone with a rape drug or a rape audiophile or something like that where the child can barely function and doesn't know what's going on is okay with you today. 